everybody, it's John DePietro. I am in Elkhart, Indiana, and I am here with Mr. Jim Rogers from KOA. Some people thought it was Century 21, but it's really KOA. And uh, you just addressed a group, and uh, you're damn good. Well, KOA is great, and it's uh, always an honor to represent it. I, I think the opportunity here is you've got so much uh, energy in this uh, industry in Elkhart, and uh, I just want them to realize how appreciative we are of what they do, as well as to sort of give them that outside-in perspective that indicates that there's so much yet to be had. That's got to be the easiest opening question you've ever had, had right? No, you always give me you always give me a zinger, and it's always a pleasure to be here with you and your audiences to talk about this uh, wonderful business that we're in. And and again, I'm I'm the optimist. I continue to believe that uh, we have yet to uh, see the best. And uh, if we can encourage some of these uh, manufacturers and dealers that are here, as well as all over the United States, to uh, spend a little more time with their campground partner, we think everybody will benefit. We, we have Bob Zagami and I have been saying this for years. Why not put? a motorhome or travel trailer or fifth wheel at a campground when people who are already in that lifestyle I mean, they're more likely to buy than a new person who knows nothing. Well, and, uh, and, and typically in most campgrounds, uh, you do have the churn. So if you do have a vehicle there, you got a new audience every day. So instead of waiting for people to come to a dealer's showroom, why don't you come to where the people are, you know, where the campers exactly. are? And, the, and the, if, if, look, if the research indicated there wasn't a very great chance to sell to existing customers, but the research indicates that 70% 70 of it. I mean, you said 70%. 70%, that's huge. Un unheard of in, in most industries, no right? Question. That, I mean, that's, that's uh, gosh, I mean, that's uh, such a success rate. And when you consider the cost of investing in this, it's not going out and buying a fishing rod or a new sleeping bag. This is a major investment. And 70% are saying we're going to buy again. So why not let them have the opportunity to see what it looks like in a campground setting instead of a showroom or a convention center, right? With the, with the birds chirping and the fire out front. It's, it's the uh, whole idea of sales as a sizzle, you know, and I think that, uh, indeed, we've got the sizzle in the campground with all the things that we're doing. We're, we're wonderful with the destination services that we provided, and the opportunity to us is to begin to try a pilot somewhere. I mean, I'd like to come back to this group a year from now and say we actually tried it. I've had two or three dealers come up to me after this and say, hey, I, I'm, 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 so we came here to try to find some a manufacturer, a dealer, and a campground system that wants to kind of put this together and come back and report back to the industry how it works. It doesn't work fine, but at least we gave it a try. Right now, we just keep talking about it. And you know somebody, at least from the campground side. Yeah, we, we're, I'm, I'm be able to convince uh, hopefully a few of our uh, owners that this would make benefit for them because I think that they're better serving their guests and the possibility of using the unit that's on the campground to rent it at night like another uh, you know cabin super from Elkhart it's John DePietro along with Jim Rogers saying let's go camping